Hi, um, my name is Mark Tonkin. Um, I'm from Design Technology and Innovation, which is a, um, a small intellectual property company based in the UK. Uh, we were lucky enough to be invited to take part in Launch Water, which was the inaugural um, launch event. Um, in fact, we were so lucky that when we were originally invited, we turned it down. Um, but fortunately, um, we were persuaded that turning it down wasn't such a good idea. We were invited to come out and um, present our technology, which is a saline irrigation system for growing plants without having to desalinate water, uh, which was quite well received by launch. Um, and more than that, it was also very well received by NASA, who were uh, very interested in the technology from the point of use in low gravity up on the space station and um, potentially for um, going even further deeper into space. And as a result of that, um, we were able to uh, license our technology to DuPont very successfully. And subsequently, we've been invited back by launch to take part as a council member, helping to um, give the advantage of our um, knowledge from doing the first launch to the new innovators. And we're very pleased to do that and enjoy the conference very much. Uh, the impact rotations are actually probably the most useful part of launch. Um, doing the presentation really fills in the council members with what you're doing and what you think your aspirations are. During the impact rotations, the council members become the creative part of the element. And the impact rotations give you other people's perspective on your short um, intro into your business. And everybody has a slightly different perspective. But the support comes from the council members actually being creative and thinking through what your business is and how they can help your business to progress to maybe um, commercialization, or it may be that you're not that close to it, but it gives you a different uh, um, perspective on the direction that perhaps you should go. And they help, to, um, they, they help to show you that there is more than one way to do the things that you think there's only one way to do. And as a, as a council member myself, my point is to try and just illuminate to the innovators um, exactly what help they can get from these people, which would be very difficult for them to get without launch, because launch enables them to talk to people that they would find very, very, very difficult to get hold of without somebody saying, I can put you in touch with A, B, or C at such and such a company. And from that point of view, launch is extremely good. And whereas at general conferences, you network with a few people which you may or may not see again, the council members at launch are all here to do one thing, and that's to help the innovators. And that is what they do. And that is very, very useful as an innovator. I can, I can say from my personal experience that um, the council members were the people that really pointed us in a slightly different direction and just refocused what we were doing and made it possible for us to license the technology where we would probably be a year or maybe two years behind otherwise. Being a council member is a, is a different experience uh, because all of a sudden, rather than trying to persuade people that you have a good idea, you're now on the other side of the fence and you have somebody who is trying to persuade you that their idea is good. And because we have a business as well, uh, which has benefited from launch, it means that, that, um, that I get to see it from the other side. And when I see the innovators presenting their ideas, the first thing that happens is you start to think, actually, there are ways that we could be involved in that or there are ways that we could possibly support that. But that support is, is from a commercial point of view. Um, in other words, we could m maybe partner with some of them um, and, and actually as a business grow and maybe grow into areas which we wouldn't have gone to before simply because we have a technology which could be um, put together with, with theirs and go in a completely different direction. And so from a, a council's perspective, um, we learn that there's uh, ways of growing our business which we hadn't thought of before, very much in the way that the innovators are being persuaded by, by the other council members. And our business benefits from that. Uh, we also benefit from hearing other council members and their views on somebody else's business because a lot of what they have to say is still um, very positive and very useful for us. So we're getting the benefit of, of, of their views and just adapting it to our business. So we, we benefit at each stage as council members, as well as, from my point of view, 
Um, I think it's important for us to be council members because we can help innovators in a process that helped us hugely. And it's, it's right that we should basically put back. It sounds rather cliche, doesn't it? But, but I mean, that is the case, that we are helping people, but we're getting benefit ourselves. So it, it, it isn't a one-way process.